person and a look. Technology is constantly growing, and it's making its way into the classroom. That's something we're really proud of now, is that we've been able to implement uh, the Chromebooks into the schools. When the Higgins was rebuilt, a tech plan came along with it. I wanted to make sure that we had the technology that our students needed to succeed. But it didn't start so easily. There was not really a central push behind how we're going to use it. It was more like a play. Jared Haas was part of the wave of teachers trying to figure out how to go about the tech initiative. I got together a, a group of other like-minded teachers called the Tech Study Group, and we took a look and we just talked about what we were doing with technology. Todd Busey came up with a, a vision that we were going to be uh, a one-to-one -one school. The idea that every student would have a device and it would be uh, um, an expectation that, that lessons and learning would be blended between technology and, and traditional methods. Here's how it works. When you get to the Higgins, you get your own Chromebook, like this one, and you would use it all throughout your three years. When you get to the high school, the same thing applies, only this time it's yours to keep even after graduation. However, right now, not all students get this perk. I feel that we're at a disadvantage because we don't have Chromebooks or other technological means like that. Lily is a junior at the high school. She and other juniors and seniors don't have the advantage of owning a Chromebook. I'm in certain classes that are with underclassmen who have Chromebooks and I'm handicapped because teachers will be like, all right, take out your Chromebooks and we're gonna work on something online and I can't do that because I don't have access to the internet and um, just different platforms that I would if I had a Chromebook. There is a way for students to use a Chromebook who don't have them. It just takes a little bit of planning. Because so many of the students, the freshmen, the sophomores have Chromebooks now, it's easier to get loaners for our juniors and senior classes. So I would say it takes more planning because I have to know, oh, I'm going to use the Chromebooks this day and book them for my classes that don't have them. Um, you can be more spontaneous when they have them with them in class all the time. Soon, each student will have one. It will be two more years until we can do that fully. I wanted to make sure all of our kids um, you know, had that advantage and had that ability. And students will have that advantage. Continuing to work with the Tech Initiative means that more students will have easy accessibility to technology in schools. And it only gets better from here. Mayor Betancourt is excited to continue to work with the school board to come up with new ways to enhance learning in the classroom. And Chromebooks are only the beginning. For Peabody Access, I'm Eleni Mata.